Howdy do do there everyone, my name is Pear Howdy, I'm hoping you guys are having a good day today. And welcome back to the third episode of uh, the Matt Reader 100 Day series here. Hope you guys are having a good day today. As you can tell, Matt Reader's kind of just living the high life right now. He's just kind of chilling out. Uh, welcome back. Welcome back. Um, if you're new to this series, by the way, uh, I'd highly recommend checking out the previous episodes as it'll help you explain a lot of things. We have some things I'd like to get done today. We are going, my plan today is I would like to go and check out over here in this like little area over here. I know it's a little bit uh, vague on what exactly I'd like to do but I really am uh wanting to get into this baseball field that we checked out in the last episode but I can't get to it because there's just so many uh, zombies there and I have no weapons to do anything with so I was thinking a lot about from the last episode how we found a lot of maps right we found a lot like a lot a lot and so I wanted to go ahead and do something in order to you know make this challenge still a bit fair I guess if you want to call it that so um, going on, going forward, we are going to uh, only count maps for points, if that makes any sense. So zombie kills are no longer going to be counting as points because we're at, we're in a very populous area in the game. And so we're coming into this, the situation of, I keep finding way too many maps to the point where I'm literally just like having no problems expanding my map. And so just to keep things restricted, I would like to kind of, you know, put that restriction on myself and all that shit. So, uh, as I said, my plan today is we're going to head up north a little bit today because I want to go check out those areas over there. And I might actually go and go down this way and check out those houses over there. I'm curious what this building is. Um, because it seems to be pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. No zombies. It's a community center. Okay, so we might have some keys over here. I'd like to check out some more of these cars and get that zombie over there who has that um, good duffel bag. We gotta see what's in there. Like I said, this baseball bat is fucking OP as shit. All right, we got one more zombie real quick. Hold on, hold on. Fucking one shot, moving on. Uh, ooh, gas can, that's really good. Uh, we also got a car in the last episode, which is Really what I'm, I'm just like, holy shit, we've had so much progression in this series so far. A Toyota, we got a Toyota Land Cruiser. I think this is the 1987 Land Cruiser, right? All right, I think the engine on this one is pretty bad. Uh, maybe if we put some gas in it, because we do have a gas can. Don't want to go that way. Any other way but that direction would be good. Ooh, this is perfect right here. Okay, it's not, no, don't jump through. Oh shit, I was about to say. I didn't want to jump through. I wanted to remove the glass. I don't really want to be here very long. I haven't had, I haven't cleared this place out yet. So the safety of being in here is a very, very fleeting thing. I need blunt weapon, a purse with a gun in it. Okay. We'll take that with us. No, oh, I'm starting to take pain and we got a skill in maintenance. Oh, shit. Oh, he has a mallet, though. Shit, you fucking scared me, man. We may need to head home. I don't think I have painkillers on me. I have sleeping tablets, but I don't have painkillers on me. Which is a problem. Because painkillers are my, uh... Because my character has really poor feet. Uh, his feet hurt really easily so i have to like be really careful with when running and shit like that all right i might just yeah we're gonna back up for now okay so the community center was a bit of a bust because we have nothing there that i can really use but really the only places i want to go are this way now so maybe going up here and exploring this retail center here would be pretty good. Trying to get an idea and the, like a lay of the lamb, I get lay of the land, I guess. Like I said, we have a lot of painkillers. All right, we're going to head back out just a little bit. I don't know if any zombies followed us this way. Okay, stop taking pain, please. For two fucking seconds. Please. This is the worst fucking trade I have. Is pain. Oh, hell no. Not while I'm like this. What if we went this way? Let's see how bad it is over here. The the really big thing I'm I'm worried about is just like 
just getting into a really bad horde or something like that. Move broken glass. Get that off real quick. How bad is the zombies out here? That's super bad. <laughs> and a battery. Take a battery. Oh. 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 Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Get out. 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 What is it? What is it? What is it? Oh, it's just a scratch. Oh, thank fuck. It's a scratch. Every time I get an injury in this fucking game, it's a fucking bite. So thank fuck it's just a scratch. Oh my gosh. I, I cannot express to you right now how many nerves just went down my fucking spine right now. I'm going home and I'm disinfecting. I'm not taking any fucking chances with this character. Holy shit. I'm serious when I say this. My worst fucking fear is this character dying in like the first three days. I'm serious. I don't know how many failed runs I've had where I die in like the first day or so is a stupid fucking bullshit. I know I want to still go up here, but that area is a little bit too scary for me. So we're going to go this way. What's the, what, what's the worst that could happen? I say that knowing that my character, this will be the final time that my character comes home. I say that jokingly. And I hope not to take it seriously. But before we do that, let's go get something to eat. Sponsored by nobody. Because I'm not a channel who's big enough to get, get, get sponsors. Oh, shit, 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 shit. We're going right back towards the uh, baseball field for now. All right, let's just take out the zombies where I can. Just be careful, don't just back up. If I get too overwhelmed. Imagine I make that new rule where we're gonna stop doing zombie kills and I just like never find another map of Louisville and this whole challenge just falls to nothing. Like this is what I dealt with in the last episode. This was fucking crazy. <gasps> There's an ambulance right there, yo. Oh no. Uh oh. There we go. I was wondering if we were gonna find a map of Louisville this episode. Glad my, glad my, uh, glad I was, glad I was right at least partially. Okay, that ambulance could be really fucking cool though. I want to check it out. Okay, there's two more zombies right there. Is there any more over here? No. Okay, yes. There's a couple down this way on the way that I wanted to go to. I really want to check this ambulance out. I gotta see if there's anything in here. You guys don't pay attention to me. We just be cool and be chill. And I'll be chill with y'all. Oh my gosh, this is fucking awesome. If I imagine if we can get all this. Imagine if we can get away with all this. Okay, we're good. I'm gonna head upstairs and we're gonna retreat for now to a nice comfy bed. My character's tired. He's sleepy. Look, bunnies. I remember that. That's kind of funny. All right, we have a whole store to to go deal with. Uh oh, chicken is going bad. Trout, stale. That's not good. All this is, but it's what? But it's like okay. All right. Um, but we do have all this all this frozen stuff. So, like I said, I want to deal with all of this stuff. I want to cook it all. I want to eat it all. Go through that stuff first before we deal with all of our stuff like this. And yeah, all these are probably bad too. Except for these. These are good. So we definitely... Anything that's fresh I want to take with me and put in my fr fridge. Sulfuric acid. I didn't know that would be here. All right. How's it, how good is this car, by the way? I'm really curious. Holy shit, this car fucking rocks. Damn, look at this shit. And to think... We got this car last episode, which is episode fucking two. That is ridiculous. Oh, cowboy hat, friend. Give me your fucking hat, you bastard. Okay, there's a couple of them, including another cow fellow cowboy hat wearer. That's pretty cool. If we can get in here, that actually would be pretty cool. Nothing? No alarms? Nothing? Dude, an alarm is going to be the absolute fucking worst. When that, when that happens, we are, like, completely fucked. I'm sorry. It, it's going to be hell on earth. I'll leave the fedora here for another another man to find. Another Redditor will know. He will know what we must do. I'm trying to make I'm trying to make jokes with the fedora cuz uh in the last episode I did I was watching it back and I was just like, "Damn, I didn't know. I made. I just did, made like one joke, and that was it. I was, I was like, "Damn, that sucks." 
Baseball bat. Yes, 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 yes. Exactly what I'm looking for. Long blunt weapons. Exactly what I need. Dude, it'd be really funny if, if we had like actual like cook. <gasps> Holy shit. Holy shit. That is a whole horde. Oh, I am not ready for that. I am 110% sure that I am not ready for that bullshit. It sucks that we have to take so many constant breaks because my character takes so takes so much has all of this shit going on. I have to take constant breaks just to make sure that it, we don't have issues with this pain. Can I not use the shower? Is the shower fucking useless? Uh oh. Wait a second. Did the water go out? Water went out. No. Oh shit. Oh hell no. This is exactly what I was talking about. I didn't prepare for. We're what? What we started on the ninth? We're like seven days in. We're a week in and the power in the water went out. And I'm pretty sure if I go to bed or sleep right now, which I might do to replenish all my shit, I'm fairly certain that we're gonna that I'm gonna end up losing my power too. And we just got milk and shit like that. Okay, now we have to address the issue of water running out. I need to collect any water that I can grab. Because I'm out of because my bedroom just ran out of water. We just need to start being a little bit more saving about our water situation. I know this is this is not all of our water, by the way. This is not all of our liquid liquids. I just want to have a, a good bit up here too. Same with food. I want to have food up here too. Come on, we're, we literally have a fucking we just we are water hoarding, baby. We're gonna sell it on eBay. This is exactly what people on eBay do. They sell shit. Even if like a zombie apocalypse happened, you know exactly what would fucking happen. People on eBay would post. Things like essential kit for zombie survival, five hundred dollars, and somehow it would get like nine bids for like a grand or some shit. All right, I'm just gonna probably take some sleeping pills and then sleep. I do hope you have enjoyed this episode, by the way, if you have considered comment, liking, and subscribing as we continue on this epic journey towards the 100 days. Because where I am. So, uh, yeah. Uh, until then, this has been Barry Howdy. Wishing you guys a good rest of your day. Sing! Later!